Welcome back to GamecocksOnline.com. I'm joined by Junior Jess Vastein after the Garnet and Black scrimmage. And Jess, you had a couple of different roles today uh, for the teams. Talk about kind of your performance and how you felt you did kind of getting those competitive juices flowing. Um, well, I got to play libero and outside today, but I'm happy to play whatever the team needs me to do and whatever makes us win and get back to the NCAA tournament. I really don't care what I have to do. <laughs> How did it feel to kind of get the team in an environment where, you know, you got the video board on, you got the fans in the stands cheering you on, and kind of get that, that, that rust off from last year and kind of having the break, even though you guys have been practicing, to kind of get in that more game-like feel? Well, we've been here most of summer, if not all summer, and working and trying to do the best we can without coaches. So now to have our coaches back and our fans back and the whole game day set up in the CVC, it feels really good. This is the fans' first chance to get a look at the freshman class and see them in action, and it might be your guys' first real look at them in a kind of a game environment. How do you feel that they did uh, step it up today in the scrimmage? I thought they all stepped up. It's, but there's six of them, which is a lot of our team, and I think they all stepped up, played their role, and did their job today, which is exciting to see. You got a weekend off coming up, not, maybe not off from uh, practice, but off from competition before you guys get going the end of August. So, what are some things that you hope to do personally and the team needs to do to kind of get ready for that August 30th uh, start? Well, I think having Garnet and Black this weekend and an off weekend next weekend is really helpful for us to like go through and watch our like competitive real game setup and see what we need to work on before we get to a real match and pit. Jess, thanks for your time. Thank you, Joe.